What's up guys, today I'll show you the best emulator for the Nintendo DS console. First thing, you will go to the Google Play. Type NDS emulator. Scroll down. Super 3DS Multi Emulator. Go here. You will now install the app. And when you download it, you download the files for the 3DS games or NDS games you want to play. Open the app. How do you integrate games in the application? Go to settings. You have here directory, Nintendo DS folder. Open the folder. And as you can see, I have already downloaded a couple of games, which I will show you the gameplay of all of them. You go here, use this folder, allow. And all the games that you downloaded are here. First game we, we will play is Plants vs Zombies, the most basic game. For Plants vs Zombies, you use the touch screen. Let's skip this part, so you can see you just press the plant, and there it is. The game is around 30 megabytes on the NDS, while on the Google Play Store it's about 200. So it's a big difference for the game that hasn't changed for over 20 years. So if you want to save this state, hold down this button here. Here. Click save button. And you have four states. We'll go state one. And it is saved. Load. Here it is, state one. That's how you save and load the games. Oh, yeah. Dimulator has ads, but that's what you can ex uh, expect from these kind of emulators. The next game we can play Lego Batman. Playing Lego Batman. Same goes here, save the state, state 1, and you can exit the game. We have G G GTA Chinatown Wars, Assault Urban Legends, Pokemon Go, actually not Pokemon Go, but a Pokemon game. Now I will show you GTA and Call of Duty Mobile. Not Call of Duty Mobile, but Call of Duty Black Ops. Save state 1. That's it. Now we can next the, to the main menu. And now I will show you GTA and Call of Duty. When it comes to Call of Duty, When it comes to GTA, we need to use the touch and the controller, but as you can see it works perfectly with a controller, which is a big plus.
So guys, that is it for my best ND simulator. If you like the video, make sure to leave a like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video.